Greetings and salutations, I'm Keb, welcome back to this let's play of, or rather the stream of uh, Stellaris with the Broman Empire. It's been a week since we played around, we were still in the middle of the War of Heaven, if I recall correctly. Let me see if I can... Yeah, uh, that's what's going on, right, right, right. We're... The problem here is that um, we won't be able to win this, which is kind of unfortunate. Uh, because uh, our war exhaustion is most likely going to hit 100% uh, before we are a before we hold all their planets. Which is the requirement. At least as far as I understand. And that means that they can wi force us, uh, uh, force a white piece on us. Which is unfortunate. I really also really wish I could see which systems my uh, fellow <laughs> alliance members have claimed, because it's really annoying to go in here and see that every single system is just handed over to everyone else. Grrr. After I do all the work, it really, really irks me, but oh well. It is what it is. So most likely he's claimed everything here, which is original all his core systems. How many plans do I still have left? I mean, we still, we're still we still working on his uh, home system. Uh, there are the plans there, 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 not there. That's three plants over there, two down there, and this one, and these over there. Now, if he, if this fallen empire hadn't just gobbled up the purifiers in the early game, and I still don't understand how the hell that's reasonable, that a purifier that basically holds 12, 15 planets can just disappear in a defensive war against the fallen empire. That, that strikes me as broken. Ah oh, well. That's the complaint of the hour. Now, this is a... I just loaded the game, so hopefully these numbers will adjust themselves a little bit, otherwise we're going to be in big trouble. Of course, uh, the Federation thing is why we have such a huge problem. Um, yeah, maintenance cost is increased by 42%, yay. Anyway, let's see, what uh, what the hell else have we go do we have going on? Uh, right, we just settled our ring world. Um, do you upgrade that? Are we seriously, seriously suffering those that kind of losses? Because I can't quite make this compute. The losses seem way greater than they should be. I'm hoping it's just a reload issue. Now, I'm not playing on the um, beta patch. By, by the time this goes up on YouTube, for that matter. Um, then most likely the beta patch will long since have been released as a proper patch. But yeah, one of the things that the beta patch fixes is that you can keep going after hitting 100% war exhaustion. Uh, but unfortunately that's not going to be the case now. Um, I still find it really funny that everyone and their brother joined this federation. Um, yeah, they're only... The guys... The, yeah, those guys are hostile to us. That's, that's a pretty much because they signed up up here. Everyone else... Everyone else, and I do mean everyone, went with us. Well, not these guys, because they were in a civil war at the time. Sort of. Oh yeah, and we also have um, have the contingency about to fire. So life is about to get interesting. So even if this one fails, then we'll see what happens. Anyway, we are going to crawl forward. And I do mean crawl. Because I want to see... What's going on here first? Okay, so you adjusted numbers. Good. Good. <laughs> that had me a bit panicked. Anyway. Uh, station engaged. And... Stop that. Stop that. There we go. Which station are engaged? Um, right, I'm sending you around to just bop up small stations that they most, the, the other guys probably haven't claimed. And... Um, Let's see, I told you guys to go there, that's fine. Uh, are you heading for one each? You are. That leaves the transports, which I think are up here. And you're headed straight for Mother. Good, 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 good. Everything mostly fine then. So you have four, fly, uh, four uh, fleets there. Where are my other fleets? Uh, you... Yeah, right, that's that one. You're down here to repair and... Refit, I hope. Oh, no, no, this is the, um... Throwaway fleet. 
with the dreadnought and all those, yeah. Crappy ships. So we have one fleet there. You're there. You. Where the hell am I sending you? Oh, right, over to this one. Fine. Now, I don't know exactly where the enemy is. We've seen a ton of ships here. Uh, no, let's see if we can find the major fleet like this one. Uh, following 235... That's uh, this one. Yeah, okay, so you're trying to catch that, that little fleet. Uh, which way will you go? They could, they could use the wormhole. That's probably what they're going to do. I will see. I'm hoping that my allies will actually do things. Because they don't seem to be doing too much other than losing. I mean, there's a f small enough fleet here that they can actually compete with it. Right? Oh yeah. You can kill this fleet if you want to. Of course, that's the wormhole, so that's where the other fleet's gonna <laughs> emerge, most likely. Ah. They do have a few smaller fleets there, that's not really gonna be a problem. Down here, those fleets are slightly more powerful. Still not that much, th not all that much, though. Um... Have we begun invading here yet? Oh, wait, you haven't arrived yet? What? Didn't I send my transport? There they are. Okay, slightly more than slowest then. Let's see if we can get this done. Uh, fleet capacity really jumped up, that's what uh, nullified uh, or evened out those numbers. Um, that's that space battle, lovely. That means you're taking this star. Move on to next one. He's, a, he's at 100%. We are at 86. We still need to capture all those planets in order to have any chance. At least I, I think I need to capture all these planets. So if he hadn't taken over every single planet that belonged to the <laughs> purifiers earlier, we just might have had a chance. Anyway, attack. I would love for him to just, you know, cave if I manage to take most of his core planets, which we have done at this point. I think he started with these two as well. But that's it. You're there to take out the uh, trade postal, or the, uh, that thing. Invading yeah. mm -hmm. Invading Xenolair indeed. Now, this game is definitely in the end game. <laughs> I mean, we're past for 2400. Um, we're already building green worlds, and I want to keep doing that uh, as soon as we stabilize this, or as soon as this war is over. Then we'll probably start focusing on rebuilding our fleets because the contingency is about to fire. Which could be uh, quite interesting for us. Okay, uh, that's that. Yeah, we know there are some. Do I want to do that though? We can easily go through these systems. And you've claimed them. Okay, so there aren't any hostiles there anymore. Never mind. Those are, That's just a fake echo. We can go there and clear the system and go on to the next one. Everything fine. So, how's the ground nation going? I'm gonna keep it on slow for a bit just to see what happens. I wanna see one as we crawl up our war exhaustion. Well, I kinda know what's gonna happen. The second we hit 100% on our own war exhaustion, we are just going to be white beast out, I think. And that's going to most likely validate the achievement for winning the war in heaven. That's what I'm a bit upset about. Uh, I'm building more warframes, by the way. I think I am. Uh, or not. Yeah, we're terraforming a whole bunch of planets. Didn't I start building more than... I thought it did. Uh, do, 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 do. Our military planet that was here, I think. No, we have some transport fleets here. So I do you think we have queued up a whole bunch of uh, armies? Yeah, we have. Never mind. Okay, so you took out that one. Lovely. Move on. And of course, he claimed it. 
take out this, just, you know. Oh yeah, go pump around here. See if we can, like, tie his system together. There we go, there's a proper fleet. Um, where are you heading? You are chasing down uh, this guy. Is that the one from down here? No, so he has... His entire force is now chasing down our poor, poor raiders. That's fine by me, so we'll just have to try to stay out of their way. Uh, unfortunately, he'll have to go through... Actually, we could intercept him here. As soon as... If, he'll not be up here but before we've uh, taken care of these uh, planets, I think. At least I hope so. It's going to take a while to get through these defensive armies of his. Broken and disengaged, huh? Die, defenders. We take it. We're taking a heavy toll. But still. Okay, you're still moving. And you're still fighting. Just takes you longer to actually reach the center. He's just gonna bounce up here, at the very least. And probably avoid this fleet because they can actually hurt him. And there's a star base there. Go there and then down here, I guess. He has probably claimed a whole bunch of systems here, though. Or maybe he hasn't. Maybe he hasn't, because... Uh, he can't go there. Anyway. Wait a second, you're already there. Oh, dear me. Um, You're moving faster than I expected. Much faster. That ain't good. Um, so you're gonna jump over there. Um... If I go here, you're going to intercept me. I think I just might, you know, jump all the way back here <laughs> and group up a bit. I think so. I don't want to. I don't want to move in his way. Not with this fleet. I want to just see if I can intercept him here instead. Yeah, it has to go down there. Of course, by the, yeah, we'll see what we can do here. Okay, uh, you guys took out the star. Excellent. Keep doing that. Yeah, I, I don't know. No, we can't have claimed these stars because they... They would have cost a fortune to claim. He took them, though. Oh, well. We do have some unrest from occupied planets. That's fine. Come on. Just a few more to go. Then we'll go straight for Sid Cradle. He's, we are at 88. War in heaven, war goal. Demanding unoccupied claims. Yeah, because everyone is claiming stuff, right? <laughs> so we need to occupy all of this stuff. That, or all the stuff he's claimed. Which is probably everything. Before they're even willing to surrender. <sighs> so basically the AI is going to screw me over for, from the achievement, even though See they've done... Right. Even if they've done pretty much nothing. Rumble. And of course now they're gonna turn that over, right? That's at least what my That's at least my guess. Go over there and just land armies. No, we still have control, but uh he's in control of the system. I assume it's gonna be handed over just like everything else. Which irks me. I mean, we're giving him a whole bunch of very, very juicy planets. Uh, yeah, you're still... Invading Zeno Lair. Still coming through. So are you, right? Jump to... Oh, that's what you're doing. You're using jumps. To fact. To where? Uh, 
Oh dear, he's jumping here. Ah, uh, whoopsie. Do you, do, 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 do you stop that? Then you move like... Let's, uh, you know... See if we can do this. <laughs> um, or do I want him to fight? No, I don't. Because that's gonna, you know... Reduce uh, or increase our war exhaustion. So we don't want that. Now we're invading his own planet. Uh, I want to jump down there. He's still attacking me there, but uh, he's not actually jumping. Uh, that's a transport fleet. That's uh, actually moving. Okay, so I want you and you. I think you're actually the one bombarding cradle. I'll probably want two fleets before I jump in here. So he jumped down there, and he's still following me, right? Yeah, he did not take those systems, though. Did he? Uh, I can't... Dang it, how do I do this? See, um, yeah, he's gonna wipe that fleet out, that's a given. I almost wish I'd gone in, you know, because he would have been vulnerable, right? Because of the jump thing. Of course, he'd still have, he'd still have crushed it. Um, if he follows me, he's gonna take out these systems and reclaim them. Which is not what I want. Because the war is just gonna suddenly end with the, with the status quo. At least I imagine so. In which case we just might want... You know what? Um, I could try to move down there and... Whoa! That's actually a good point. There is a warp hole and uh, warp, warp point that down there. He was waiting to jump. You know what? Um, move the fleet back here for a second. And you also move there. Kind of depends on what this guy's gonna do. It looks like he's gonna use the slow crawl, which I and I assume he's gonna go down this way. Uh, right, you're just guarding. Actually, leave the other one there. You guys, head out. As well. Four of the fleets down there, so we can jump down and see if we can intercept this guy. Uh, no, he's changed. Now following Zuzuza Armada. Which I have no idea what is, but that's what you're doing. Which means you're not following these guys anymore. You also change your... What? Okay, the Zuzuza Armada. What the... Where the hell is that? That doesn't sound like one of mine, at least. The Zuzuza Armada. It must be a fleet somewhere. But who's using the Zuzuza? Is there any way for me to, like, search for fleet? Uh, this is not Zuzuza. Are you using something Zuzuza things? Are you using Zuzuzaz? Uh, let's see, you're using the Star Order list, so it's not you. 
Got it. You... Keepers. So it's not you. <laughs> Is it something here? Taking plants and like oh it's such a such, such a mess. Um, anyway, I don't know. They're not following us, at least. But finding them, which, which one they're actually following is gonna be uh, suitably annoying. Uh, essentially, I want to see where you're moving. Uh, now you're attacking Starbase. Whatever that means. Which direction are you actually heading? Okay, you're heading this way. Got it. You. Uh, now you're attacking one of mine. Number three. Which uh, is not one of these. That's two. We're attacking three. Oh! The one bombarding you to bits. Yes, by all means come here. It's gonna be fun if you do. Are you actually coming through? Didn't even take the star base. Okay, I'm inclined to try to fight you, so... Could move everything here. Oh, you're so toast. Uh, are you moving? Okay, so you're now going this way, trying to avoid my entire fleet here, which makes perfect sense. I'm not sure what the hell he's gonna do. You're gonna just, you know, stay there for a moment. Um, I need to kill these. So he's gonna move down this way. Um, that's okay with me. But tell you to jump there. And you. It's well within range. Clear chassis 3. Uh, not that. Stop, stop, stop. Jump. All of you jump there. Uh, they shouldn't have a star base or anything like that there. Should be fine. I mean, I could jump straight on top of him. Um, extend the contract. That's fine. Oh, you took the star base there. Of course you did. But they're still coming down this way, so if I jump in over there, hopefully, complete. hopefully I'll be able to intercept you. Did you actually not tra transfer this? Mother is not transferred. Really? Well then. It might not transfer them until I've taken all the planets. Okay, so we jumped, I think. Yeah, we jumped. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. The summons. As the ghost signal has grown in strength, continued analysis has uh, revealed that it's uh, transmitting energy patterns that mimic those found not only in a synthetic unit's basics, uh, basic positronic brain, 
but those transmitted between our main core and our unit's neural clusters, interfering with their control modules, this can't be good, uh, and uh, causing erroneous behavior. In accordance with prior observations, the pattern replicates differently in different situa in different entities. While our kind are commanded uh, to destroy, most synths are uh, primed to set course for the signal source uh, unconditionally, and judging by their uh, fervor, it will not be long before they reach their destination. We have yet to find a way to block the signal. Not good. I should say. So, yeah, life could get very interesting very, very quickly here.